Hi guys, it's Devin, Birdie's Beauty Director, and I'm here with the Naked Skin Shapeshifter Contour Palette. Four powder shades, three-ish contour ones, although this is really more of like a matte highlight and a shimmer pearl for highlight. And then on the other side are the creams. Two contour shades, these are color correcting shades to neutralize darkness under the eyes and then a shimmer pearl shade. So really it's kind of a three-in-one palette where you're getting contour, highlight, and color correction. And we're gonna need the brush. So this is a new brush specifically designed to go with the Shape Shifter palette. It is the Pro Contour Shape Shifter brush. So it's dual-sided. The domed edge is really for blending and basically applying everything but the highlight. That's what you have this beautiful big fan brush for. We're gonna start with the creams. Really, you can do whatever you want with this palette. You could do creams only, you could do powders only, but if you're gonna layer, do the creams first. I'll start right here. Oh, yep, there it is. Just along under my cheekbones. So kind of just stippling in the pigment and then blending it out. I like to use these circular motions and that's really what the domed brush is great for. So you can really blend as much as you want. And we can add more if we're feeling something a little more sculpted. Just a little bit along my temples. Okay, it's looking good. And I'm using this kind of dark cream. Getting a little under my chin. That just helps when you're looking straight ahead. It kind of creates a little bit more of a shadow. Avoid any double chin action that may surface. Maybe just a swift line down each side of the nose. That color looks great. And now I'm gonna to top it off with some powder. I'm gonna go in uh, with the little slightly lighter shade. It's a little bit cooler. And I think I'm gonna actually use the highlighting brush. You can just dust it on and it just kind of goes right over where the cream went to just intensify it and also help it last. So this is gonna boost that stain powder. So that's the contour and now go in for the highlight. I'm gonna switch to my fingers because I've only ever applied highlight with my fingers. I feel like it looks more natural. I'm gonna use a little bit of the matte cream first, just on the high points. I actually didn't wear highlighter today just so I could do this authentically. It's actually quite nice. I usually only use an iridescent highlighter, but this matte shade is really nice. And you can do a little Bridge of your nose, center of your chin, basically anywhere the light would catch. And now for the cream. It's not too shimmery. It's like very fine. And just kind of dabbing that over where I already was, just to add a little bit more dimension. Just a little here and there. Beautiful. You can tell it's very fine. All of the pigments are finely milled and it just kind of Blends right in. Oh, oh my gosh, I almost forgot to do the color correctors. So there's two shades here, the pink and the peach. I will use a little bit of the pink because I'm very fair. And you can also mix them. So I might do just like a little tap of the pink right in the inner corner to brighten up. And then for the real darkness, because we all have them, use the peach. Let's see if this is too dark for me. Oh no, that looks nice. Typically you would put your concealer on over a color corrector and it kind of just knocks out the darkness and then the concealer evens everything out. But I kind of like the way this is looking on its own. I think I look nice and sculpted, didn't go crazy. And the highlight, you see that nice C shape? Really catches the light. I think it looks good. I like this. This is actually a great tool. I, like I said, I rarely use brushes when applying contour or highlight, but I really did like the control it gave me. I think we have a winner, guys. It's the Urban Decay Naked Skin Shape Shifter Contour Palette. It's really fun, and there's really a way to use it for everyone. So check it out. It's out now. And yeah, tell us what else is new and now and happening. Leave us a comment below. Bye, guys.